Walker City Park Leech Lake Walleye Tournament, seventh annual here, and we'll be broadcasting live here on KQ 102, 101.9 FM until noon. The official weigh-in starts at at three. We have partly cloudy skies here. 42 degrees is our temperature. North northeast wind for the fishermen today at uh, about 11 miles per hour. Hi, welcome to Midwest Outdoors here at the 7th Annual Leech Lake Walleye Tournament in Walker, Minnesota. I'm Dana Pitt with the Leech Lake Tourism Bureau, and this morning we had 155 teams take off from the city park in Walker, all competing for over $40,000 in cash and prizes. Stay tuned as we follow the boats around and follow the action today. Tournament rules allow each team to weigh six fish a day. Out of that six fish, one fish can be over 26 inches. Leech Lake has a slot limit of 20 to 26, so anything in between that has to go back. You just watched a boat there catch a really nice fish. Unfortunately, it was 20 and a half inches, so it was a half inch too long, had to put it back. Uh, if you can get those fish that are just under 20 and then get your one big fish over 26, you'd be in really good shape today. How's it going for you? Great. Good. Let's see we have. Yeah? Got a big one? Big fish in the boat yet? Yeah, we already weighed it. Oh, really? Good. Since we've been here, we've had uh, three fish come in, one boat. Uh, the big one was just over uh, five pounds. Last year, the winner of this tournament was uh, 28 pounds, just over 28 pounds. So hopefully they got a good day of fishing. Leech Lake has definitely been hot, one of the uh, best lakes in the States. So we're going to head back to Phil Baker at the station here in Walker. Join us live here at the Walker City Park. We'll be broadcasting until noon. Back to you, Phil. You know, with 155 teams on the lake, you'd think there'd be boats all over the place, but they tend to scatter all over on this lake. There's 112,000 acres here. Uh, so it took some running around, but we did find quite a few boats. We talked to quite a few people, and it seemed to be most of the people have got quite a few fish in the box. Uh, they're catching a lot of fish in the slot, which, you know, up to that 20, 25 and a half inch range, which are really fun fish to catch. Doesn't do them any good in the tournament, unfortunately, but uh, for anybody coming up just to fish the lake, they're, they're a blast to catch that fish that size. Uh, it's getting mid-afternoon now. Weigh-in is going to be starting fairly soon. Let's stop in and see what happens. Big fish in the morning or afternoon? Afternoon. All right, that's a great catch. Oh, it was a little slow today. Um, caught a couple right away in the morning and then uh, worked, worked some points and uh, ended up picking up that big one right around noon or so. 7-12 on the big fish. Uh, we had six fish, we had uh, 15.44 pounds. So good day for us. Well, Leech Lake's had a great history of tournaments on this lake. The PWT's been here several times, the FLW, MWC, uh, Cabela's Circuit. There's been a lot of different professional circuits here, but it all started uh, back when Al here started some local stuff similar to what we have right now. Yeah, and it just uh, led to a tournament after tournament, kept going, Dan, it got bigger and bigger, and now it's just a fabulous tournament, and it's uh, non-profits going the money to the place where it should to kids and to the buildings that we need to have. And it was set up for people to come and enjoy themselves in the categories, not just as a professional fisher, but right. a weekend time to have some fun. Kids, families, husband, wife. And that has continued on and that's been great. It's just good to see it. Well, it makes it great for the community because it's, you know, the money comes back into the community again. It isn't yep. just people using the lake and taking the, the, the oh, resource that's exactly down. Right. So. That's exactly right. That's where we've had a tremendous bite from the fishes. You know, yeah. not a better fishery than this one right now at this point, so.
Well, day one of the Leech Lake Walleye Tournament is on the books. And from the looks of it, it was a great day. There were 644 fish weighed today. A little surprising to some people, considering that two days ago, the temperature, air temperature is about 30 degrees warmer. So with the cold front, thought it might be a little tougher bite, but this lake just keeps kicking out fish. Uh, there's still almost 50 people or 50 teams that are within one big fish of the lead, so it's anybody's game yet. Stay tuned for the results tomorrow and see who takes home the $13,000 paycheck. Stay tuned for more Midwest Outdoors. Looking for your window to the outdoors? We have you covered with a Midwest Outdoors magazine subscription. Call now, 1-800-606-FISH, and for the low price of only $14.95, you receive 12 big issues of Midwest Outdoors magazine. Every month, Midwest Outdoors sends you the ultimate fishing and hunting guide to the outdoors. Call 1-800-606-FISH, or visit MidwestOutdoors.com to get your ultimate guide to the outdoors. If you don't have one, you need one. Welcome back to day two of the Leech Lake Walleye Tournament. Just a few minutes ago, 155 boats took off from the city park in Walker. It's a nice day. We've got a little chop in the water, some clouds. Uh, we've talked to a couple boats already. This looks like they're getting some fish, so it looks like a good day for everybody. Most of the teams we've talked to have been primarily jigging with a jig and a minnow, uh, which is pretty typical for this time of year on this lake. Uh, we're about late May right now, but as you start getting into June, it starts to transition over into leeches and crawlers. Uh, so this time of year, almost anything can go. Uh, like I say, most people are jigs and minnows, but we have seen some people that are rigging with some night crawlers. And of course, for the big fish, they, a lindy rig and a big chub is always a way to go for those. Right here is the husband and wife team of uh, Brian and Heather Brosdahl, or Bro, as you've probably seen in my Midwest Outdoors before. He just caught a nice 23 and a half inch fish. A lot of the teams are getting those nice fish in the slot. Uh, like I said before, that doesn't do them any good in the tournament, but boy, that's a great fun fish to catch. Uh, something that anybody can come up and do. This isn't complicated. It's a jig and a minnow in shallow water. and uh, Come on up and you can catch fish like that too. Most of the teams we've seen on the lake today have, no, have had no problem getting numbers of fish. A lot of them have five fish in the box. They're holding back on that 6-1, just waiting for that big one over 26, which will probably determine who's going to win today. Uh, yesterday, there were many teams that were within just a few pounds of the lead, so anybody can take it. It's just going to be who gets that big fish. Uh, Weigh-in time is approaching, so let's head in and see who's going to cash the big check. The Leech Lake Tournament Committee takes releasing fish very seriously. They do their best to keep the fish cool, to pump fresh water on them, to get them released back in the lake as soon as possible. Over the past five years of the tournament, the release rate has been over 90%. That means more fish back in the lake for you to come and catch. In third place, with a payout of $4,100, the grand total of 28.91 pounds, boat number 101 of Dirkman and Dirkman. In second place, we have boat number 14 of Olsen and Kopchak. 
Things were really tight in this year's tournament, and we thank all of our anglers who participated, but our grand champion for the 2015 Leech Lake Walleye Tournament with a payout of $13,200 and a total weight of 31.57 pounds, boat number 118 of Curb and Sutton. So what, uh, what worked for you the last couple of days? I mean, obviously you got some big fish, but you also uh, were able to uh, bring in a great total, 31 pounds. Last year the tournament was won with just under 28, so what was the secret? Well, the first day it happened to be crawlers for us fishing in the cabbage, and uh, today it happened to be jigs and shiners in, in the shallows and the rocks. Uh, that, that made a difference. Two, two spots, won the tournament for us. And versatility. Well, maybe a little, and a lot of luck. Okay, well, yeah. luck's important too. So, well, we really appreciate it, and congratulations once again on being our grand champions. Yeah. Thank you. Thank you. Well, that's a wrap for the 2015 Leech Lake Walleye Tournament. What a great tournament they had. Almost 1,300 fish were brought to the scales. And a special congratulations to the team of Curb and Sutton on a great tournament. They had big fish both days. They ended up with over 31 pounds in weight. What a great job, guys. For more information on Leech Lake, the area, the fishing, and this tournament, check out the website at the bottom of the screen. I'm Dana Pitt with the Leech Lake Tourism Bureau, and stay tuned for more Midwest Outdoors. Mm -hmm.